This person perceives you as a beacon of mental fortitude, someone whose inner strength remains steadfast in the face of attempts to play mind games. Your resilience is evident, emanating from every aspect of your being, making their efforts to manipulate futile. Instead, they find themselves drawn to your unyielding personality, compelled to engage with you on a deeper level. Your strength acts like a magnetic force, irresistibly pulling them closer, despite any reservations they may harbor. Amidst living your abundant life, you have achieved a remarkable equilibrium between your emotions and rationality. This balance contributes to your unwavering presence and the profound impact you have on those around you. Your mastery of balance is evident as you navigate the intricacies of human interaction with grace and composure. Instead of succumbing to reactive impulses, you approach each situation with level-headed responsiveness, guided by wisdom. This ability to remain composed in the face of adversity sets you apart, bestowing upon you an aura of stability and wisdom that others find captivating. Your unwavering determination to stay true to yourself is truly admirable, serving as an inspiration to those around you. By maintaining this steadfastness and authenticity, you continue to navigate life's challenges with resilience and grace, leaving a lasting impact on those you encounter. When you declare the end of a cycle, it's not merely a suggestion but a definitive statement of closure. Your clarity and decisiveness are both refreshing and intimidating to those who underestimated your resolve. In hindsight, this person regrets not taking your connection more seriously. They admit to testing the waters instead of trusting their instincts, a mistake that ultimately led to them letting you slip away. Now, they find themselves yearning for your attention, recognizing the depth of your character and the authenticity you exude. They admire your strength and genuineness, yet they are burdened by the regret of having misjudged you in the past. Their previous dismissal of your character weighs heavily on their conscience, a label they now realize was unjust and unkind. The shame they feel for their past actions serves as a constant reminder of their own fallibility. As they reflect on their actions, they are consumed by thoughts of what could have been. They wish they had approached the connection with you differently, regretting the times they let doubt cloud their judgment. The memories of your time together evoke a sense of nostalgia, reminding them of the moments they took for granted. In hindsight, they see the value in your presence and the depth of the connection they once shared. Despite their remorse, they acknowledge the significance of your bond and long for the opportunity to make amends. They find solace in the knowledge that you are a woman of integrity, someone who refuses to be defined by others' perceptions. Your strength and resilience serve as a source of inspiration, prompting them to reevaluate their own actions and beliefs. They long to make amends, to show you the respect and admiration you deserve. To them, you are more than just a strong woman, you are a force to be reckoned with. Your unwavering resolve and steadfastness command respect, drawing others to you like moths to a flame. Though they may have faltered in the past, they now recognize the error of their ways and seek to make amends. Your influence on their life is undeniable, leaving an indelible mark that will forever shape their perception of themselves and others. They acknowledge the role you've played in their growth and development, and they are committed to honoring that influence by becoming better versions of themselves. I deeply regret the role I played in your unhappiness, and the pain I caused you weighs heavily on my heart. It's a burden I carry with profound regret. Looking back, I see a series of missteps, missed opportunities, and misguided beliefs that led to the deterioration of what we once shared. For that, I am truly sorry. In the aftermath of our separation, I've undergone a process of deep introspection and self-discovery. It was a necessary journey, albeit a painful one, to confront the reality of my actions and their impact on you. The realization hit me like a tidal wave. I had been blind to the depth of your love, the significance of your presence in my life, 
and the fragility of our connection in the midst of our relationship. I operated under the assumption that I could do no wrong, that my words and deeds held an inherent righteousness that would always keep you by my side. But such arrogance blinded me to the truth that relationships require nurturing, understanding, and unwavering effort from both parties. I failed to see you as you truly were, a beautiful, complex individual deserving of love, respect, and appreciation. The breakup served as a wake-up call, shaking me from my complacency and forcing me to confront the harsh reality of my behavior. It was a humbling experience one that shattered the illusion of invincibility I had constructed around myself. Suddenly, I found myself adrift, grappling with the enormity of my mistakes and the gaping void left by your absence. Since then, I've dedicated myself wholeheartedly to the process of self-improvement. I've delved into the depths of my soul, excavating long-buried insecurities, fears, and shortcomings. It has been a journey marked by pain, discomfort, and moments of profound revelation. I've had to confront uncomfortable truths about myself, my arrogance, my selfishness, my inability to truly empathize with others. But through this process, I've also discovered a reservoir of strength, resilience, and determination within myself. I've learned to acknowledge my flaws without succumbing to despair, to confront my demons without losing sight of the person I aspire to be. Every day is a struggle, a battle against the darkness that threatens to consume me. But I persevere, fueled by the hope of redemption and the desire to make amends. I realize now that I took you for granted, assuming that your love would always be there to sustain me regardless of my actions. It was a foolish, selfish belief, one that I deeply regret. I failed to appreciate the depth of your love, the sacrifices you made for me, and the ways in which you enriched my life. But even in the depths of my despair, even as I grapple with the consequences of my actions, one truth remains unshakable, my love for you endures. It is a flame that burns bright, a beacon of hope in the darkness that threatens to consume me. You are my heart, my soul, my everything, and I cannot imagine a future without you in it. I understand that words alone cannot undo the pain I've caused you, nor can they magically mend the rift between us. But please know that every word I speak comes from the depths of my heart, every apology is sincere, every promise genuine. I am committed to making amends, to proving myself worthy of your love, to being the person you deserve. So I ask for your forgiveness, not because I expect it, but because I believe in the power of redemption, in the possibility of second chances. I know that rebuilding what we once had will not be easy, that it will require patience, understanding, and a willingness to confront the demons that threaten to tear us apart. But I am willing to do whatever it takes, to go to any lengths, to earn back your trust, your love, your forgiveness. All I ask is for the chance to make things right, to prove that I am capable of change, of growth, of becoming the person you need me to be. You are my love, my light, my salvation, and I will spend the rest of my days trying to be worthy of you. This silence, this void of communication between us, feels like an endless chasm swallowing me whole. Each passing moment without your presence, without the reassurance of your voice or the comfort of your words, amplifies the uncertainty that gnaws at my core. I find myself caught in a perpetual struggle, unable to discern the right moment to reach out to you. It's as though I'm tiptoeing on a tightrope stretched between anticipation and apprehension, uncertain of which way to lean. In the quiet of the night, when the world around me is enveloped in slumber, my mind races with thoughts of you. I wonder if you're awake, if you're pondering over the same questions that torment me. The uncertainty of whether you'll respond to my message or pick up my call leaves me in a state of constant flux. Will you acknowledge my outreach with warmth, or will your silence echo back, amplifying the ache in my chest? The mere thought of your indifference sends shivers down my spine, and I'm left grappling with the fear of rejection. 
Amidst this whirlwind of emotions, one thing remains certain, I yearn to be the best version of myself for you. I'm acutely aware of the weight that each word carries, the significance of every gesture. I want to approach you with thoughtfulness and preparation to ensure that my actions reflect the depth of my feelings for you. I'm willing to shed the layers of insecurity and uncertainty, striving to embody the epitome of who I aspire to be. My passion for you burns bright, an inferno that consumes my every thought. There's a magnetic pull drawing me towards you, an inexplicable force that defies rationality. I find solace in your presence, a sense of completeness that transcends mere companionship. It's as though my soul recognizes yours, resonating in harmony with an unspoken understanding. Yet, despite the intensity of my emotions, I'm plagued by the ghosts of my past. Reflecting on my previous behavior, I'm filled with remorse for the times I've acted immaturely. There are moments when I cringe at the memory of my words and deeds, wishing desperately for a chance to rewrite history. I realize now the folly of my actions, the damage inflicted by thoughtless words spoken in haste. In those moments of vulnerability, I'm humbled by the depth of my regret, yearning for forgiveness and redemption. And yet, even as I strive for self-improvement, the specter of doubt continues to loom over me. I find myself consumed by thoughts of whether your attention is diverted elsewhere, if I'm merely a passing thought in the tapestry of your life. The rational part of me knows better, trusts in the bond we share. But the darker recesses of my mind spin tales of abandonment and neglect. It's a constant battle, this tug of war between faith and fear, between love and insecurity. Despite the tumultuous storm raging within me, one truth remains steadfast, I desire no one else but you, both emotionally and sensually. The very thought of seeking solace in another's arms feels like a betrayal, a sacrilege against the sanctity of our connection. Your essence permeates every aspect of my being, your presence an indelible mark upon my soul. I find myself unable to envision a future devoid of you, your thoughts a constant companion in the labyrinth of my mind. In the quietude of this moment, as I lay bare my innermost thoughts and desires, I'm filled with a sense of urgency. I cannot bear the thought of letting another day pass in silence, of allowing this chasm to widen any further. I long to bridge the gap between us, to reach out across the expanse and grasp hold of the connection that binds us together. For in the end, amidst all the uncertainty and doubt, one truth remains unshakable, I love you, now and always.